so today happy easter but the tea for today is orange yeah the typical tea um so my setup is a little weird right now and i'm not gonna show in detail right now but the reason why i'm at this angle is because i moved my desk against my window so it's like half against the window and half against this other wall as opposed to being on that wall so my room's feeling like a different room now it feels a little bit smaller i'm not gonna lie which is why i was worried about moving it this way but i just felt like having my desk facing that way was so like not having it face a window is so like depressing and I just feel like it's easier for me to film stuff. I don't have like a good tripod right now. There's makeup all over my hands. So yeah, I just think this is better. Um, so yeah, that's my journey. <laughs> but even though it feels smaller, like I don't really care. It looks, it's a lot more convenient having my desk right next to my nightstand. And again, later when I organize everything, it'll look better and I can show it. But yeah, like having stuff accessible in here, having my phone charger be able to be right here is nice. So yeah, just home things. Um, what else am I going to do? Oh, I wanted to sketch this new painting because I have have this newfound obsession with the movie Fern Gully. It's actually called Fern Gully, The Last Rainforest, which I always thought it was just Fern Gully. <laughs> but yeah, I didn't really know that other people knew about that movie. It's kind of one of those hidden gem movies. Um, but I used to watch it a lot when I was a kid, I think. But I feel like, like I watched it the other night and I feel like I've never really watched it. Like I didn't recognize any of the scenes. I didn't know what the movie was really about. I think because I was too young to like process what the message was, but it's actually such a good message about saving the rainforest and saving the environment. So if you've never watched it, or even if you have, just definitely watch it. It's on everywhere. It's on like Prime, Tubi, YouTube. So yeah. And Tubi and YouTube are free, so you should watch it because it's just so cute and like I feel like it's gonna be my new go-to like falling asleep movie. <laughs> if you don't know, I get very obsessed with movies and I kind of like all my life I've always had certain ones that I could just watch over and over every day and yeah, I might do that. But yeah, I wanted to sketch a new painting about it because it's just so beautiful. I also kind of wanted to dress up like Krista for Halloween this year, so hopefully I can do that, but yeah. And the cast is like so star-studded, it's crazy. Like look up the cast, you'll be surprised. I was, because I'm like, I thought this was a movie no one knew about and here it is like packed with all these famous people and like if you watch the behind the scenes of the movie it's really interesting so i really recommend that too but yeah so fern gully obsessed um but yeah i want to do a painting basically um just like movie poster style where it has like all the characters I'll have like Krista and Pips. I don't want to include Hexus just because even though he's like probably everyone's favorite character, um, he doesn't really fit the aesthetic <laughs> that I'm going for. I'm going for like really capturing the nature aspect and like the magical fairy aspect. I want to include like gold detailing and stuff like that. So yeah. Also, Hexus is the villain, so it doesn't really go. <laughs> but anyway, yeah, that's what I'm going to do. I want to start by baking 
a chocolate cake. It's just gonna be like the Funfetti Pillsbury chocolate, which is so interesting. I feel like that one tastes better than regular chocolate. I don't know why. Maybe it's because I don't know. Like Funfetti is always better. But anyway, I'm gonna do that and probably prep the frosting and then set it in the fridge. Okay, so you can kind of see the little setup that I did to cover the scuffs on the wall. Um, but yeah, I put up my, oh my gosh. I put up my Ace poster from the Siren album. And I just put some like random photo cards up there too. I just made some ravioli it's like a uh, tomato no it's like squash tomato i think i don't know it has an interesting flavor it's like pretty sweet can you see it's like orange inside it looks like pumpkin um so yeah i finished making the cake as you saw looks really cute if you saw my ColourPop haul in the last video um i don't know if i mentioned but they did forget one thing which was the thing that i was looking forward to the most which was this lux lip gloss it's called or it's like a liquid lip yeah and it's in the shade flynn because rapunzel is like my favorite disney princess it's so pretty and yeah, like that's an example of one of the movies that I could just watch over and over again and not get tired of it. And it's so comforting. So yeah, I really wanted this. So cute. Um, it's like a navy glittery cap and it's like a mauve shade mauve shade mm. it smells like it smells like lip gloss from like the 90s or 2000s because i feel like when i was little my mom had lip glosses that smelled like this oh my gosh nostalgia so yeah 
looks like that okay i totally thought i was filming that whole time wow but i wasn't but i just put the liquid lip on and i didn't put it on very well also i'm not wearing like skin makeup so it's not the full effect of what it would be but i like it oh my gosh it's like on my <laughs> i can't see very well in here Wow, I actually really like this color because I don't really have, I thought I did have a color like this, but I don't think so. And it's not very matte feeling. It looks pretty matte, but it's actually, I thought it was going to be like heavy because I feel like that's what liquid lip products do, but it's not. And I did a very thin coat. So you probably could build it up, but it's, the texture is very like oily. It's more like a lip oil. But yeah, I would put gloss over and stuff, but yeah. Okay, I actually love this. I wasn't expecting to. I mean, just by the looks, it's like pretty scary, but it's actually like so good. So, highly recommend. Okay, so I did my makeup and I cut my hair yesterday. I did like really short layers. Um, I was really inspired by Sugi and I tried to style it, but I don't really like it. It's a little too much of a wave, but yeah, I kind of made, I made like really short bangs and stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm still trying to learn how to do that. But let's address these stickers. I just kind of wanted to use them. And I'm not taking like pictures for the feed, but I just wanted to to try this. Look at my table. But yeah, I think this is going to be the end of the vlog. So thank you guys for watching. And I'll see you in the next one. Bye.